science. Um, so my goal is for everybody to, to feel after the course that they could take another class in chemistry um, and it wouldn't be scary. Uh, and then it might actually be exciting or something that they wanted to do. Um, sometimes the, the idea of taking the conceptual understanding of chemistry and the calculation-based parts of the course um, and putting it all together seems a bit daunting um, to students in general. Um, some students are totally fine with it. Um, others might find the calculation side of things a little scary or the conceptual side of things a little bit scary. Um, so I think using um, different types of technology that allow students to review a concept over and over again or at their own pace um, so that they can um, watch a certain um, video or a pencast and pause it in a moment and think about it and reflect on it or take notes. I think that that's a really powerful way to, to learn. Well, her um, pencasts were very helpful for me because um, if in class I might have missed something, um, going back home and or going back to my room and um, doing the homework, it was really helpful to be able to watch it and then have to do homework that was the exact same thing. Um, and mm -hmm. also, one nice thing about the pencast is that especially using it as a study material, I could make it so that I could just look at the beginning of it and um, like write down the problem and try and do it myself. And then if I didn't, if I got it wrong, I could literally look at it step by step and she would be teaching it to me. And it's like, it doesn't even require you going to see her. And then if I needed, I could always go see her for extra help if I needed that. So mm -hmm. that was really helpful. The other thing that I've seen is when they watch those videos um, or pencasts that the questions they then come to me with after watching it are more advanced questions. Um, so instead of just saying, could you go over this concept in general, um, they ask me questions that show that they're trying to figure out why you do the calculation or um, why, what, why do numbers when they're used in certain ways mean different things um, rather than just how do you do this. Mm -hmm. um, so I think it allows our interactions to be um, to be a bit, a bit more complex and in depth. It's just not the same as just having that resource where you can just like rewatch it and rewatch it. That's what that's what I would do with them. I would watch them and then I would like go back and go to all the parts that I didn't understand. And before tests and homework, um, it would be so helpful. I definitely think without the pencast, my grade would not have been as good as it was. I think the, tech, the benefit <laughs> here again is that um, each student is able to kind of. Um, mold the class to his or her needs um, using these technologies. So um, if a student wants to review conversions 17 times, they can do that on their own. Um, I want them to feel empowered and, and uh, as independent learners through the process rather than feeling weird about having questions. Mm -hmm.